Oh, I loved it. Although I must admit, I'm getting rather bored with all that nudity. Oh, well, that couple in front of us was interesting. <laughs> I wonder if Bruce is home. He probably is. All he had was his English finals yesterday and the bank picketing this morning. I'll peek. Hey, Mary. Hmm? What's this? Oh, that's one of those hot curler sets. Is it yours? No. It's probably Sherry. She probably stopped by to see Bruce. Hmm. Well, I'm sure he's not home. Well, I'll just check. Joe. Guess what? He's not home. Oh, he's home all right. But he's got a girl in bed with him. It's not his teddy bear. You sure? Of course I'm sure. Those must be her curlers. That means she's planning to stay? I don't know. Bruce is only 18. He could walk when he was six months. Oh, heavens, they were asleep. Asleep? He was asleep? What's wrong with that? Well, it seems a little strange. I mean, in bed, asleep, oh. considering his circumstances. Yes, I see what you mean. Joe, I feel very peculiar about this. We've got to handle this just right. Suppose she's still here in the morning. I could offer her breakfast, like I've always done for Bruce's other little friends. You don't think they're married, do you? Bruce is too young to get a marriage license. Maybe he got a learner's permit. <laughs> no, no, we're we're being, being too darn modern about this. We've got to do something. I've got it. Why don't we sneak off to a motel before they catch us? <laughs> I'll write him a note. Dear Bruce, we are spending the night in the motel because... How would you put it, dear? Well, I, I just say... Oh, Joe, this is crazy. This is our home. <laughs> Dial a prayer. Calling him on his own number. Well, what do we do when he answers? Hang up. And he'll look at the clock, realize how late it is. If he wants to send her home, he can do it. We'll hide in the linen glove. Oh, I forgot to have it cleaned out. No answer. Joe, did you ever speak to Bruce about sex? Of course I did. Beautiful, natural, nothing to be ashamed of. Don't ever feel guilty. Now look. Should have told him it's beautiful, natural, nothing to be ashamed of after you're married. <laughs> you know who I feel sorry for? Sherry. Wonder where she figures in his plans. Well, he's pinned to Sherry. Well, honey, there's a difference between pinning and. <laughs> hey, could that girl in there possibly be Sherry? She'd never dye her hair that shade. Sherry wouldn't mind. Yeah, this whole new morality. Any girl would mind. Still, remember, he was reading all about that sexual freedom league. No, I persuaded him to join my fraternity instead. As I remember your fraternity, there isn't much difference. <laughs> I know. Why don't we go to bed right now and sleep very, very, very late? I think that is a great, great, great idea. <laughs> that way we cannot sleep them. 
be interesting to see if he tells us about it. Oh, sure, he'll tell us. I just hope he doesn't get too technical. You know how he is about cars. <laughs> just remember. We can't sleep, sleep, sleep. I've got a golf date at 6 a.m. That's right. With Dan Lawler. Yeah, he's picking me up here. And my clubs are in Bruce's room. Everything's in Bruce's room. <laughs> what if I try to get the clubs? Suppose I wake them up. That would be the worst, to actually catch them. Yeah, you can see it now. She wakes up, sees me, screams, clutches the blankets to her. What was she wearing? Long hair. Couldn't be long enough. I better cancel again. Oh, Joe. Why cancel your game? They haven't canceled theirs. Why don't you go in right now and get your clubs? Now? Yes. Not even the phone call woke them. Yeah. I work. Hey, I got a great idea. Just in case, give me one of your stockings. My stocking? Mm-hmm. Okay. wake up, they'll think I'm just a friendly neighborhood burglar. <laughs> Don't look now, but you gotta run. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I really feel terrible about this. I mean, it's so late and everything, but, well, Bruce made me promise that I'd drop by the minute I got home. He expected you today? No, tomorrow, but I finished my exams early. <laughs> Thought I'd surprise him. Oh, you certainly will. Well, oh, listen, I'll just tiptoe on uh, this. Uh, Sherry! Oh, it's only me, Sherry! <laughs> Sherry! You look just like a burglar. What? You're looking at the original golf nut. Oh, yeah, well, uh... See, I had this great idea for winter golf. You put the stocking over your head, see, and then you, you, you look at the ball through the runner. Sherry was on her way in to see Bruce. Bruce? Oh, Bruce! Bruce, yeah, well, Bruce isn't here yet. He's not. Gee, I hope nothing's happened. So do I. Oh, well, he's home from college. That doesn't mean he isn't here right now. He's probably out with the boys. Incidentally, are you two still pinned? Well, we were planning to get married, but... We decided that for the time being, Bruce should channel his energies in other directions. Well, since Bruce isn't here, I don't imagine you want to stay and talk to two old squares like us. Well, listen, will you have him call me sure, tomorrow? Sure. Good night. Good night. Hey, what's all the noise in here? Sherry! Well, Bruce, I, I thought you weren't home. Of course I'm home. Who said I wasn't home? Well, they did. Well, well, we didn't hear you snore. What are you talking about? I don't snore. Well, I guess that's why we didn't hear you. I'm trying to protect you, you dope. Protect me? What are you trying to protect me from? What a gap. Maybe he doesn't need protecting, dear. After all, they look at things differently today. Oh, that's Gene. Now you've woken Gene up. Oh, well, well uh, good night. Uh, good night, uh, Jerry. What is going on look, here? Look, there are some things that a girl just shouldn't have to face. Yeah, no matter how liberated you kids that's think right. you are. <laughs> My parents are getting weirder and weirder. Your Gene? Gene Wright. Nice to meet you. Uh, He's Gene. Isn't that wonderful? Are those your girlies? No, they belong to my girlfriend. She left them here when she dropped me off. Gene, I was never so happy to meet anyone in my whole life. Look at that lovely long hair. Hey, Bruce, your parents are really right on. Yeah. You know, you never can fit your parents. Maybe now with computers. I thought his long hair would really turn them off, but... Look at that. Hey, you play golf? Oh, yeah. As a matter of fact, I do. What's your handicap? Four? Uh, 